What is the law of demand and supply? The law of demand and supply, fundamental principles in economics, explain the interactions between consumers and producers in a market economy. These principles were developed over time through the contributions of renowned economists, shaping our understanding of how prices and quantities of goods and services are determined. The law of demand asserts that, all else being equal, as the price of a good or service decreases, the quantity demanded by consumers increases. This inverse relationship between price and quantity demanded was formalized and conceptualized in the mid-19th century by economist Alfred Marshall. Marshall's pioneering work laid the groundwork for modern microeconomics and brought attention to the interplay of consumer behavior with prices. This phenomenon can be explained by the fact that as prices fall, consumers perceive the good as more affordable and thus are more willing and able to buy more of it. Complementary to the law of demand, the law of supply states that, again, assuming all else remains constant, as the price of a good or service rises, the quantity supplied by producers increases. This principle, originally explored by early economists, such as Francois Quesnay in the 18th century, gained prominence with the work of Alfred Marshall and his contemporaries. As the price of a good increases, producers find it more profitable to supply more of that good, aiming to capitalize on the higher price. The equilibrium between demand and supply forms the cornerstone of market dynamics. When the quantity demanded equals the quantity supplied at a specific price, the market is said to be in equilibrium. The equilibrium price and quantity are determined at the point where these two curves intersect. Economist Adam Smith, often hailed as the father of economics, introduced the concept of an invisible hand in his seminal work, The Wealth of Nations, in 1776. He theorized that individual self-interest, when pursuing their own gains, unintentionally contributes to the overall well-being of society. This concept reinforces the law of demand and supply, as consumers' pursuit of lower prices and producers' pursuit of profit collectively lead to a balanced market. Over time, economists have further refined these principles. The elasticity of demand and supply measures the responsiveness of quantities to changes in prices. Developed in the 19th century by economist Alfred Marshall, elasticity allows us to understand how sensitive consumers and producers are to price changes and provides valuable insights into market behavior. In conclusion, the law of demand and supply forms the bedrock of microeconomic theory. Alfred Marshall's contributions, along with insights from Adam Smith and other economists, have shaped our comprehension of market dynamics and the intricate balance between consumer preferences and producer incentives. These principles, embedded in the foundations of economics, continue to guide our understanding of pricing, allocation, and decision-making in a world of limited resources and unlimited wants.